Welcome to aminacademy.com. In electrical engineering, let us discuss about cathode ray tube, that is CRT tube. The CRT is a display screen which produces images in the form of the video signal. It is a type of vacuum tube which displays images when the electron beam through electron guns or strikes on the photofluorescent surface. In other words, the CRT generates the beams, accelerate it at high velocity and deflect it for a creating image on the phot phosphorus screen so that the beam becomes visible that is CRT tube is working. Look at this figure. Here this is a base voltage. We are giving the voltage source here and heater. Then these are cathode. Due to heating up this it becomes that electrons is fastly removed and very with very high velocity it strikes the screen on fluorescent screen it shows the image now look at this these are the grid this focusing onward accelerating onward horizontal deflection plate as well as the vertical uh, deflection plate also fitted here now this completely is called an electron gun and how it's work we can see now. The working CRT depends on the movement of electron beams. The electron guns generate sharply focused electrons which are accelerated at high voltages. High voltage. This high velocity electron beam when strikes on the fluorescent screen creates luminous spot. It creates a luminous spot in the screen. After ex exciting from the electron gun, the beam passes through the pairs of electrostatic deflection plate. These plates deflected the beam when the voltage applied across it. The one pair of plate moves the beam upward and the second pair of plate moves the beam from one side to another. One plate moves this side and the other plates move horizontal way. The horizontal and vertical movements of the electron are independent of each other and hence the electron beam positioned anywhere on the screen. The working parts of CRT are enclosed in a vacuum glass envelope so that the emitted electron can easily move freely from one end of the tube to the other construct, other end. That means this, this uh, tube is completely vacuum. Due to that vacuum, this high velocity electron is striking the screen easily. The electron gun assembly there here the construction of CRT the parts CRT are the electron gun assembly deflection plate assembly fluorescent screen glass envelope base are the important part of the CRT. The electron gun emits the electron beam and through the deflecting plates, it is strikes on the phosphorus screen. The detailed explanation of this force is we can get further. Here, the electron gun is the source of electron beam. The electron gun has a heater, cathode, grid pre-accelerating anode, focusing anode and accelerating anode. The electrons are emitted from high emitted cathode. The cathode is cylindrical in shape and at the end of it the layer of strontium and barium oxide is deposited which emits the high emission of electron at the end of the tube. 
you this setup this high electron velocity high velocity of electron is strikes the screen easily the electron passes through the electron in a small grid that this control grid is made up of nickel material with a centrally located hole which is coaxial with the crt axis the electron which is emitted from the electron gun and passes through the control grid have high positive potential which is applied across the pre accelerating and accelerating anodes here the here due to accelerating anode the electron beam is passes very fast because it's attracting electron beam is negative charge so it attracting through the focusing anode so it's go very fast and strike the beam is focused by focusing anode the accelerating and focusing electrons are cylindrical in shape which has a small opening in the center of each electrode after ex exciting the focusing anode the beam passes through the vertical and the horizontal deflecting plates the pre accelerating and the accelerating anode are connected to the positive high voltage about 1500 volts and the focusing anode are connected to the lower voltage of about 500 volt there are two methods of focusing the electron beam there are the electrostatic focusing beam and the electromagnetic focusing focusing the electrostatic deflection plates how it works the deflection plate produces the uniform electrostatic field only in the in one direction the electron beam entering into the deflection plates will accelerate only in the one direction that and hence electrons will not move in the other direction <coughs> now we will discuss about screen for crt <coughs> here the screen is here how it's work see now the front of the crt is called the face plate the plate the face plate of the crt is made up of entirely fiber optics which has special characteristics the internal surface of the face plate is coated with the phosphor the phosphorus converts the electrical energy into light energy the energy level of the phosphorus crystal rises when the electron beam strikes on it this phenomena is called cathode cathode luminescence since the light which is emitted through phosphorus excitation is called fluorescence when the electron beam star stop the phosphorus crystal regain their original position and releases a quantum of light energy which is called phosphorescence or persistence aqua deck the aqua deck is the aqueous solution of graphite which is connected to the secondary of the anode the aqua deck collects the secondary emitted electrons which are necessary for keeping the crt screen in the state of electrical equilibrium here this is a complete setup of crt tube and how it works we have done now we will see little about uh, what is cro the cro is mainly operated on voltages thus the other physical quantity like current strain acceleration pressure are converted into the voltage with the help of transducers and this represents on a cro cathode ray oscilloscope it is also used for knowing the waveforms transient phenomenon and other time varying quantity from a very low frequency range to the radio frequencies so far we discussed about completely about uh, how the cathode ray oscilloscope works and setup we have done please subscribe our youtube channel